Hey everyone, it is time for another box of sorcery. I am really loving this set. I'm having really good luck with my pulls. I'm not having any luck with cutting into the plastic though. It's tough plastic. Uh, so we're doing this again. I've opened, uh, this will be the fourth box I've opened. <clears throat> and I took the, the top two out of two cases. And I had really good luck with the first two from the first case and the first one from the second case. So I'm gonna try to keep that trend up here. And I will sign for unlimited booster packs right now. Let's go. <clears throat> like my playmat from Quest for the Jank Lord. Excellent YouTube channel. If you have not heard of them, go check them out. Right off the bat, we got a nice dual site here, Lighthouse. Exceptional telekinesis. Get the cool vampire. We got Hounds of Andaros, the elite beasts. Uh, let's make sure I've got my pile set up over here. Ordinaries, looking for foils. I have not found a curio yet that I know of. And so I will look through them relatively carefully. Uh, I got the, uh, the, the box topper pack. Um, yeah, having good luck with these on uh, eBay, stuff like Mix Ignis, even though it's even non-foil, is uh, a bit of a hit, so I'll put that into the hit, the hit one spot there, and then we'll have a foil spot over there, and there we go. Okay, this all figured out, don't I? Ordinaries, ordinary, ordinary, ordinary. Great. What do you guys think about sorcery? Rudy put up his daily rant today about how well it's doing. I think he's on the money f um, with his thoughts on it. For the most part, we got Earthquake. Um, that Eric, Eric's Triosa have really done a great job of releasing this product the as I predicted as well the supply even at about 30,000 boxes is not enough for this type of alpha product that has this type of nostalgia feel to it that is definitely being driven by a uh, collector mania right now um, so much so that even the second wave, this beta wave, is already selling out apparently ahead of time or ahead of release. We've got an elementalist avatar, it's halfway decent. So, yeah. I was very happy to get in on this first wave here. Uh, I am going to hang on to the big hits that I found. I've couple of foil onyx cores. I got a foil coming up in this pack as well. Got a Sky Baron. Uh, is an elite. And we've got a foil something. Mage Slayer, Ordinary Mortal. And uh, all the foils, even the ordinary foils, are uh, doing pretty well here. The regular Sorcerer Avatar there. Um, I'm, I've sold several foil uniques, not the major hit ones, for like two, three hundred bucks on eBay. So I've been pretty happy with that. As Ascalon Phoenix Elite Phoenix coming up here is a foil Flame Wave Elite Magic Ravages the Realm. Very nice. Um, stuff like this is still going for like, I don't know, might be able to get like 40 bucks for something like that, maybe even more. So and who knows where it goes from here. It's really going to depend on if the gameplay for this game takes off. It's so investor and uh, speculation driven right now, and I'll be the first to admit that yes, I'm part of that. Hounds of Andaros. Um... So it's really going to make a difference. Puppet Master, Elite Spirit. If uh, if people like playing the game, 
if they want to continue playing the game, especially if the card prices are so high, that's going to be very tough to get just the average player to want to invest this level. So this, this the beta uh, needs to really come out with a good supply for this game to take off and, and get people even more excited. This is almost like this alpha wave from Kickstarter is just like great advertising. You got people like me all over YouTube opening these up and just losing our mind about some frogs and uh, enjoying this and then like spouting off about how much money is involved in this so you're gonna get people really interested fire harpooners harpoons away and I unfortunately I have seen uh, several commenters saying that they got their box and they paid a lot for it and they didn't get a good box you know there was not any of the big unique pulls out of there depth illusionist got clamor of harpies I still think I've seen cars that I've not seen before, although I probably have. I'm just got low attention span like that. Overpower. So yeah, that's what's going on. What do you guys think down below? Has this thing got legs? Is it going to take off? Unravel, Tufted Turtles, Beast of Burden, yep. Still on the lookout for any kind of curio. I mean, they're supposed to be rare, right? It's kind of the point. Very treasure. Uh, Floodplain, Thunderstorm, Sneak Thief, Exorcism, Scorpions, Mannequin. And make sure none of those are out of the ordinary. They don't seem to be. Mummies, love the art. The Moo, Chaos Twister. Haven't seen a unique non foil yet. This could be one of those things that was the full right hand side of this box. Land Surveyor. Have I seen Land Surveyor before? It seems seems ordinary. All right, second row here. Yeah, some foil elites. Really can't complain about that so far. Spider. Got a step here. Shifting Sands and the Court Jester. This is the second time I've seen this one. It is a cool card. Totally reminded of the Jester's Cap. From Ice Age, which was such a classic at that point. Dryads. Poisonous Dagger. Cyclops. Riddle Sphinx. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Mud Flow, Gnome Hollows, Root Spider, Mask of Mayhem, Elite Armor, in the midst of a mad melee. Whenever a nearby minion can attack, it must. Nearby strikes deal double damage. Wow. That, thing's, that seems pretty good. That seems like a pretty good Elite. If I must, if I do say so. Berry. I've seen now plenty of berries. Okay. Recall. Sonic Blast, Poison Nova, Riddle Sphinx again. A little bit of duplication there. Surveyor, Pegasus, Wall of Air, Wall of Fire, and Fade. Cut. Pudge Butcher. Rolling Boulder, Quarrelsome Kobolds, Disintegrate, Spirit, Harpoons, 
while Imp were pulling this, it's Frazetta art. Kobolds, Archer, Flood, Rift Valley, Elite Sight. Getting a bit of a... Nothing too crazy out of this middle spot here. Will it pick up on the left hand side? Raise Dead, Font of Life, Apparition, Sinkhole, Elite Sight, Oil, Hounds, Exorcism, Reign of Arrows, Drown. Okay. Okay, halfway through the box here. Need a nice foil unique. Got a bullfrog, a strider, dwarven forge, elite sight, a spin attack, workers, nomads, and a sight. Wall. Wrath of the Sea, got lots of elite, and not a single unique uh, non-foil here, not a single unique foil either. Covert, Vile Imp, alright this left hand side here is going to have to come through. The Dapper Vampire got a foil here. Thunderstorm, Summoning Sphere, Scorched Earth, Elite. It is a ordinary Petrosian cavalry. And some turtles. Berserker, another foil coming up. Invention, battery around, major explosion, tremendous blast, wall of air, lampreys, explosion, harpoons. This is Undertaker en Engine Elite Automaton. So we got another Elite foil. We got now three Elite foils. Okay. Power, Heat Ray, Wizard, Phalanx, Eel, Spire Lich, Angel's Egg, another foil. What is it? Uh, Dispel, Cavalry, Ship, Leopard, Unravel, Wild Boars. Red Desert, Ordinary Sight. All right. It's, it's going to be like that, huh, Box? Give me all the Ordinaries and and uh, Elites on our foils here. That is how it will go at some, sometimes, right? Can't all be bangers. Cool looking werewolf, though. Call to War, House Arm Bannerman, Black Obelisk, Elite Relic. All ordinaries. Okay, into the left hand side here of this box. The mummies, Whirling Blades, the Skirmishers of Moo. Here we go, unique. Uh, Color out of space provides no, it gives you all four colors, but provides no mana or threshold if not adjacent to the void. Pretty solid. I think I actually already have one of these. It's up for sale on eBay right now. I want to say it's already going for about 40 bucks. So, got a little hit there. That's good. Ordinaries. Ordinary Riptide and Heat Ray. All right. this in the unique spot how do you catch a unique foil 
unique up on it. Discuss down below. Windmill. Horse Hammer Trinket, Shield Maidens, another unique, here we go, uh, Nac Nacotic Manuscript, a unique document of transmundane madness, I have not seen this one yet, Bearer has tapped to reveal your topmost spell and draw it, Bearer takes damage equal to that card's cost, seems like a good effect, so we will do something with that, Maidens, Vile Imp, Tufted Turtles, and some ordinaries. Okay. All right. Hitting the uniques now. Nope. Sometimes these packs just only want to open a certain way. And that one was like upside down. Lava Salamander. Got the Oasis. Marine Voyage. Curtis and Thay's very nice. So this Frazetta art, uh, unique. I've already sold one of these for over 200 bucks. So that is a hit and a half right there. Ordinary Beast, Ordinary Magic, Heat Ray, Ordinary Everything Else. Cool. Yeah, this is the classic Frazetta. Got the TTs on there. That's what you want. It's right there. Sea Raider, Bannerman, Upwelling, Ruler of Thule. So, this is uh, another one. And this one, I already sold one of these for 150 or so. Um, so, two nice Frazetta hits right in a row there. Ordinary, 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 ordinary. <laughs> Cool. The ruler of Thule. Crazy polar bear. Mush team there. That's great. Alright. So it's a Frazetta box, is what we got going on here. What other surprises do these last 10 or so packs hold yet? Uh, Leap Attack. Flood plane, chain lightning, jihad, another unique. There we go. The unique aura of zealous devotion. You may summon fire minions to affected sites. Allied fire minions occupying affected sites have plus one power. What is an affected site? I'm not sure. Is that just like everything around this thing? Because that sounds really good if it just summons like nine creatures, basically. Um. All right, so we got the non-foil unique stack stacking up here. It's good. Iron shackles. Uh, get the ruins. The undertow and the pathfinder avatar. Great. Amazon warriors. Lightning bolt. Caravan. The dryads. Yeah, I open it. Templar, widow, headless haunt. Um, here we go. The crown prince, unique mortal with umpteen agonates. Death right. If you control another mortal, turn, return crown prince to its owner's hand. Interesting. Dromedary. And True Sight Crossbow, exceptional crossbow. That's cool. Looks good in foil there. Okay. So I think I'll put the unique Crown Prince in his sleeve. Why not? And I don't know, the crossbow can go over here. Another foil. Wind Sylph, Wildfire, Fireball. Doomsday device, another unique. So yeah, all the uniques are on the left hand side here. That's crazy. Doomsday device, 
Unique device of mutually assured destruction enters the realm with six counters. At the end of each player's turn, remove a counter. When the last is removed, it detonates. Deals damage to each unit at affected locations, starting from 20 down to 2 on the outside. That's great. Monster, Surveyor, Extinguished, Boil, Mortality, Undertow, Exceptional Sight. Okay. Uh, let's see. We've got the Ordinaries here. Foil, Undertow. Great. Archer, Monster Hunter, Poisonous Dagger, Polymorph Elite Magic of Transfrogrification. <laughs> I had seen this card before. You're right, meaning into a frog token. That's great. Sandworms, you hate them. Pirate Ship, Snow Leopard, Overpower, and the Orbs. Upwelling, Iron Shackles, Bridge Troll, Disintegrate again. So, yeah, couple of repeats on the Elites, not too bad. Wall of Fire, Grapple Shot, Mad Dash. That one is certainly an ordinary that we've seen before, right? Can't remember. Fiend, Shrink, Phantom Steed and self same simulacrum elite fairy of sincerest flattery so this is one that can have a curio this is the regular version the curio version the middle knife is on the left there the, the the image would be flipped this way and if you look real close you can see like their faces are slightly different enough that if you looked at them next to each other you can see the difference but the big tell is the knife would be totally on the other side so this is the regular self same simulacrum now. Spell, Warriors, Foil, Cavalry, Heat Ray, Common Sense, that's it. Okay, just two more packs. Come on, you know, unique foil to really close this out here. Oasis, Whirling Blades, Skirmishers of Mew, Ghost Ship, Elite, Dryads. Maidens, mortals. Okay, one more pack. We'll call it. So this was like an okay box, right? Not a super ultra amazing box. I mean, like two Frazetta hits is pretty good, to be honest. We do have a foil, I think. Phantasmal Shade, Minecart Madness, Fey Changeling, Screaming Skull Elite. I think this one's a pretty good Elite. Um, maybe I'm. I think I tricked myself about the foil. I don't think I have a foil. Elite Relic of Unbridled Rage. Whenever bearer attacks and kills an enemy, it untaps. Demon, Sandstorm, Scarabs. Wall of Fire, Drown, Grapple Shot, Mace Slayer. So that was it. Yeah, there's no foil on that one. So there. We did end up with a nice little stack of foils. Mostly uh, Ordinaries and some Elites. And uh, got, I did end up getting some Uniques. Non foils uh, with the two Frazettas being definitely the best of the box here. But had fun doing it at least. So uh, let me know what you think down below. Should I open more boxes of sorcery? Or should I start keeping them sealed and just let them sit there and do nothing and wait to hope that they do something someday? You tell me. Catch you later.